The mustachioed man from King Charles III's coronation wants everyone to know he is not Meghan Markle in disguise. Following images of this man at the monarch's formal inauguration on May 6th, royal conspiracy theorists crowned him the Duchess of Sussex, but incognito. We'll make that more incognito, no, because he's ready to set the record straight on TikTok. Turns out he's not a dupe for the Duchess. He's highly regarded composer Sir Carl Jenkins, a.k.a. the man behind the iconic Adiemus franchise. He's also worked with Elton John and Andrew Lloyd Webber, whom he was sitting next to at the coronation. In his video, he insists the internet's got it all wrong. And this man has been a lot of interest with me since I appeared at the coronation uh, of King Charles III. I was there because I've written some music, you know, for, for the service, really. Don't ask me, there's nothing sinister about it or surprising at all. Carl also wants everyone to know his style is nothing new. I look this way all the time. And he's got the royal credentials to prove it's really him. I have in addition this round my neck, which is uh, what they give people when they get a knighthood. This was round my neck, over which my tie came. This was over the tie. One fan isn't totally convinced in the comments, saying this is just what Meghan Markle in disguise would say. Another adds, we won't tell on you, Meg. And wait, there's more. I've never seen you and Meghan Markle in the same room, sir. While another is happy that Sir Carl is taking the speculation in stride. His buddy Andrew also backs him up, sort of. After some claims the mystery man we now know is Carl was possibly out to steal the crown jewels, Lloyd Webber tweets, I can confirm it probably wasn't Meghan Markle and had no jewels on his person as far as I could see. So where was Meghan? Back in the States. She did not attend the coronation, but her husband Prince Harry did. He was seen at the event chatting with his cousins Princess Beatrice and Princess Eugenie. The Duke of Sussex sat third row for the ceremony, and when it was over, he booked it to a waiting car and bounced. Turns out the coronation fell on the same day as his and Meghan's son Archie's fourth birthday, so Dad probably wanted to get home ASAP. One thing we know for sure, his wife was not secretly on site, rocking a disguise and trying to casually blend in. Official cool dude Sir Carl is the real deal.